Welcome back. Uh, today we're going to look into how to solve two-step equations uh, with adding, subtracting, with multiplication. Now with these problems, we're going to have to uh, uh, solve them in a particular order. If we do not solve them in the correct order, we get the wrong answer. Uh, it's kind of like trying to, uh, after you double tie, uh, a double knot, a shoe, trying to pull the strings out like you would if it was a single knot. It does not work. You have to go in a particular order if you want to untie that double knot. The same thing with our equation. Now let's say you have 3y minus 2 equals 4. Um, we cannot divide the whole thing by 3 because if we do that, we're going to end up having a fraction. And if I was to do the whole problem, you would see that it would not work out at the end. It would not be equal. But to save you some time, trust me on this. You're going to have to... Uh, undo the addition or subtraction first, in this case subtraction. So we undo the subtraction with adding 2 over here, and we're going to add 2 over here as well. These cancel out, and we end up having 3y left over, and that equals 6. And we're going to go ahead and uh, undo the multiplying by 3 by simply dividing by 3. So we're going to divide both sides by 3, these cancel out, and I end up getting y equals 2. Now again, I can check my answer out by uh, plugging in the values over here, and I will do uh, 3 times my uh, value of 2 uh, minus 2 equals 4. And so I end up having 6 minus 2 equals 4. 4 equals 4. It checks out. I am correct. It is very important to uh, uh, correct or to check your work when you're doing uh, multi-step equations because uh, why wouldn't you? You can tell with multi-step equations or any equation if your answer is correct just by checking it, plugging in the values. So it seems like a very easy way to me to make sure that our answer is correct. Um, so let's try uh, one with uh, addition this time. So we're going to do 6x plus 5 equals 35. So in this case, I'm going to undo the addition by subtracting. I'm going to subtract from both sides. Uh, 5 minus 5 cancels out, and I get 6x left over. 35 minus 5 gets me 30. All right, now I can go, and I'm going to undo the multiplying. I have 6 times x. I can divide it by 6, because that's the inverse of multiplying by 6. These cancel out, and I have x equals 5. So I can go ahead and plug this in and see if it works out. So I have 6 times my 5 plus my 5 equals 35. Well, 6 times 5 is 30, plus 5 equals 35, 35 equals 35. And lucky there, I have a correct answer. Hopefully this problem is making some sense to you. We're going to go ahead and move on to another subtraction uh, equation with subtraction and multiplication. So let's go ahead and say we have 2m minus 6 equals 14. Okay, in this case, I'm going to have to undo the subtraction by adding. So I'm going to add 6 to both sides. Uh, these cancel out. I end up with 2m equals 20 and I can undo the or multiplication by dividing by 2. These cancel out I get m equals 10. Again I can go ahead and check my work over to the side and I can say that uh, 2 times the 10 minus 6 should get me 14. Let's find out. 2 times 10 is 20 Minus 6 should get me 14. It does, in fact, get me 14. Therefore, my answer is correct. Hopefully, you get in the hang of this. We're going to try one more, just for good measure, and then we will call it a day. Hopefully, you're uh, beginning to enjoy uh, the two-step equations just a little bit. I know it's, for me, I love doing equations. I think they're fun. Uh, the more complicated they get, the more challenging they are. Uh, it makes them more uh, 
satisfying when you finally get the answer and you made you know you did it right it's it's a lot of fun plus it's just a, you know you follow the simple methods and you should get the same uh, same reaction response every time if you follow the right steps you should get the right answer all right in this case we're going to get rid of our addition by subtracting eight subtracting eight these cancel out and I end up getting five w equals uh, ten and now I can go ahead and divide to get rid of my multiplication. I'm going to divide by 5. Divide by 5. These cancel out. I get W equals 2. And I can go ahead and check my work by simply plugging in the uh, answer. So 5 times 2 plus 8 should give me 18. Uh, 5 times 2 is 10 plus 8 should give me 18. And it does, in fact, give me 18 equals 18. And uh, as we see, our answer is correct. That is how you do two-step equations, adding, subtracting, with multiplication. I hope that uh, was uh, something you could understand. And uh, we'll be back a little bit later with adding, subtracting, with division. Have a great day.